Hello everyone. Today in this short video, we will discuss about important radiological points of scurvy. As you know, scurvy is a condition caused by a dietary lack of vitamin C or ascorbic acid. Hence, it is also called hypovitaminosis C. It is characterized by an increased bleeding tendency and impaired collagen synthesis, resulting in osteoporosis and impaired wound healing. Here I have drawn a picture which will help you to understand the different radiological changes of scurvy. First thing you can see here is generalized osteopenia with ground glass like appearance. Next you can see cortical thinning which is called pencil point cortex. And here this is periosteal reaction. It is due to subperiosteal hemorrhage. Here you can see dense zone of provisional calcification which is called Frankel line. Just underlying the Frankel line you can appreciate a radiolucent band like area. This metaphyseal band is called Trommerfeld zone. Next this circular opaque radiologic shadow surrounding the epiphyseal center of ossification is called Wimberger ring sign which may result from bleeding. Here you can see radiopic metaphyseal spurs that result in cupping of the metaphysis. It is called Pelkin spur. You can also see Pelkin fracture or metaphyseal corner fracture. In chest radiograph, you can see expansion of the costochondral junction, which is called scorbutic rosary. It is similar to the rachitic rosary appearance as seen in the rickets. Here, this image will help you to remember the difference between rachitic rosary and scorbutic rosary. Rosary is round and non tender in rickets. So, R for rickets and R for round. Now, rosary is sharp and tender in scurvy. So, S for scurvy and S for sharp. 